Hello, welcome to the Time for Tea Designs YouTube channel. It's Vic here today and I'm going to be showing you how I created these vellum tags. So for my tags I'm using the memory keeping essential dies so I've got some white card and some vellum so I'm just going ahead and trimming some vellum down and then I'm going to be placing that over the white piece of card and then I have that little tag die and then the enforcer and I'm just going to secure that down with some washi tape and then I'm going to go ahead and run this through my die cutting machine so I'm going to run it back and forth and then I'm just going to remove the die and these are what your tags will look like so I'm just going to carry on I've left that washi tape where it is because that secures the little circle piece and I'm going to go ahead and do this three times and then I'm going to be adding some snowflakes so I'm using the fa la 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 die and I have some white sparkly card here so I've used the snowflakes from this die set and I'm just going ahead and going to go and die cut probably about five or six of these so now I've got my snowflakes all die cut so we're going to be moving on to the stamping so I'm stamping on vellum today and I love the effect that this gives I think it looks really pretty so to start with I have the squiggly giggly stamp set and then I'm going to be using a couple of these tiny stamps from the skated penguin stamp set so I'm just popping my stamp down on my acrylic block and then I'm using some Versamark ink because I'm going to be heat embossing onto the vellum and the first one I'm using metallic gold wow embossing powder where my washi tape was super sticky it's left some residue on my vellum tag but it's easily fixed I've got a little dry paintbrush so I'm just going to go and brush away that excess embossing powder and then I'm going to be using my heat gun and I'm just going to quickly heat set the embossing powder For my second tag I'm using that Skating by Penguin stamp set and there's the little stamps that come with this stamp set so I thought they'd look really pretty. So for these small stamp sets I'm just putting them in a little group and then I'm going to pick them up with my acrylic block and then I'm applying my Versamark ink and then I'm doing this to the tag. I can see in real life where the ink is but on screen it's quite hard to see so then I'm going to go ahead and I've used some bright white embossing powder and this is by WOW and again I'm going to have to get my paintbrush out because that residue is still left there from the washi tape For my third tag I'm using the Carolyn Critters stamp set and again I'm using the smaller images that come with this stamp set so I'm doing exactly the same thing just placing them in a little group and then I'm applying this onto my tag with Versamark ink and then I've got some glitter embossing powder. So I'm just again sprinkling this over the vellum tag and then I'm going to go ahead and heat set this with my heat gun. And this powder leaves a really glittery effect so I think it looks really nice and sparkly for Christmas. So now I'm going to move on to my images so I'm using the Skating by Penguins for my images today. And I've got some Copic Friendly card and I'm using Memento Tuxedo Black ink and I'm just going to go ahead and colour in these little penguins. And these penguins I think they're so cute and they're from the last Christmas release last year but I thought they'd look so so cute on my tags today. 
So I've also left the Copic markers on the screen if you wanted to use the same colours as me. And then once my images are all coloured, I'm going to be using the coordinating dies to die cut these out. And from the same stamp set, I'm going to be using the greeting Let It Snow. So I've just got some pink pigment ink here and I'm stamping that down. And then I've also pulled out the Santa Paws stamp set. So this says Merry Christmas and I love the font on this so I'm going to be using the same pink pigment ink that I used for my first stamp. And then the last one says Love from Santa Paws so I've just got my scissors and trimmed off the piece that says Paws and I'm going to go ahead and stamp this down. And don't be afraid to trim your stamps because they will go back together if you line them up carefully on your acrylic block. So now I'm just moving on back to my tag. So I've got some ribbon here and I'm just threading this through the circle part of the tag. And I'm just using some different coloured ribbons and these will also secure your tags together so you can always write your note underneath the vellum piece or turn the tag over, it's completely up to you. So now I've got some foam tape so I'm just going to go ahead and adhere those little penguins and my sentiment to my tags. And I'm also going to be using the PVA glue to adhere down those pretty snowflakes. And then for an extra bit of sparkle, I'm going to go ahead and add some sequins. So here you can see the completed tags and you can move that vellum piece to write your sentiment. And you can see all the pretty embossing too. So I hope you give embossing on vellum a try if you haven't tried it before and thank you so much for watching the video, I hope you found it helpful, take care, see you soon.